Oh, it would make it a disaster, you know? Or I guess I'd have to take my bike, which maybe wouldn't be so much of a disaster, but... Uh, it will entirely affect the way I get around the city. Uh, I pay extra rent just because of my proximity to a SkyTrain, so... Basically, it's meaning I'm going to pay all this extra money for nothing, uh, I'll, I have no car, I'll have to work from home, you know, it's, it'll landlock me, basically. I'd be pissed off. Like, I, I seriously would be. It, it wouldn't be because, like, I'm an outreach worker in the downtown east side, and me and my dog here, it's, like, I, I don't have a license, I don't have a car, plus part of my, I want to lessen my, you know, footstep on, on, on the planet, so I, I'm a strong believer in mass transit. Um... Well, thankfully I have a car, so I can use my car, but uh, I much prefer transit. And, uh, you know, I'd have to resort to something that I wouldn't, I'd rather not do, I guess. Absolutely. I mean, I generally get around the city with a combination of biking and transit. So, I mean, if I lost the expo line, it would really mess things up for me dramatically. It's inconvenience, that's for sure, especially with uh, so many uh, people are taking the SkyTrain because of the traffic and also the parking that's always expensive. Quite substantially considering I use the ticket to school and work and I live in Burnaby. What would you have to do to sort of circumvent that? Um, if they shut those two lines then I'd have to take the bus which would increase my traffic time and I'd probably have to leave an hour earlier 